Hello, my spooky friends. How you guys been? I hope you've been well. I'm back. It's only been like two weeks, but I'm back. So today we're going to be watching a movie called The Descent, which I don't know much about other than I assume it is in some way like As Above, So Below, because that is when people started talking about it, started mentioning it to me. It's called The Descent. I don't know where we're descending, although if I had to guess, probably hell. If I've learned anything, it's probably hell. But yeah, I mean, a lot of people seem excited about this movie. It's from 2005, and that's about all I got. So thanks for being here. I appreciate you. And of course, as always, if you want to watch this movie with me completely uncut with no edits whatsoever, you can see that over on Patreon. Watch the movie with me with no edits at all. I've also got all my other horror movies uncut over there. We've got a ton of exclusive content. You can get these shout outs down here. I'm sending you guys postcards. There's a bunch of stuff over there if you want to check it out, but if you don't, that's more than okay. But as always, thank you so much to everyone who has gone over to Patreon to help support me because you guys are the reason this is all possible. So thank you so much. And um, let's watch The Descent. Oh my god, I love- you know what, I do love like the intro screens for horror films because they always start bringing in the audio immediately. They're like, okay, atmosphere, here you go. That sounds like the music of hell to me. See, that does look fun, but I also feel like I would be having a panic attack. I do have a mild fear of drowning. It's freezing. I can't feel my fingers. Oh, come here. Oh, baby. Oh, wait, that's the mother? I thought the one in the red was the mother. Wait, who's who here? Thanks, guys. I'll see you at the hotel, yeah? Oh, okay. I assumed the girl in the red was the husband. That's what it seemed like. But just kidding. Oh, but she- does she have a thing for him? It seemed like there was some awkward, you know, tension going on there. When she comes around, she can help Oh, we are in the UK. Okay. You can invite any boys this time. <laughs> Never. Not the boys. Ugh. They have cooties. Are you okay? You seem a bit distant. I'm can fine. You, can you pay attention to the road? Can you- <laughs> Oh my god! Well now the other two are gonna get together, right? Like that's the whole reason for that? What the hell is this? Is that a- oh it's a birthday cake, Never mind. I thought- I thought we were in hell already. Happy birthday, Jessica. Oh wait, she lived? Oh, I assume she died. I really assumed she was dead. Sorry. I didn't mean to like send your husband off with another woman already. I just really thought that's why you died. But you didn't die, sorry. Where's the hole? From the pole? Jess? Or is she dead? Is she dead? Wait, is she- oh wait, is she dead? I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Hi! Oh, he died! He died! He died! I'm American. My brain forgot about the switch of the steering- Sorry. A year later- Listen, we don't have to do this, you know. We can head back and stay in town. You're right, we don't have to do this. But I'm not gonna be the one to tell Juno. She's a piece of work, man. Ah! Beth! Beth! <laughs> Juno! <laughs> you look fantastic! <laughs> Hello! <gasps> hey! Hello! Oh, is this a girl's trip? Into the cabin? Dinner, in the woods? Huh? Oh, oh, we're close to the window. You know how I feel about that. <gasps> oh. oh yeah! Oh yeah! So it's one of those movies. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. That's great. She heard the kid laugh right before that came through. So, yikes! What's the necklace? There's something with that necklace. So have you done this case before? No, but they're only level two. We're quite safe. Don't worry. Can I free climb the cathedral? Chase me down the road for half a mile. What's that? What was that? I didn't see the cave. It's a cave book. The best 
When you think it's dark, when you turn out the lights, well, down there, it's pitch black. You can get dehydration, disorientation, yeah, yeah, yeah. claustrophobia, <laughs> blah, 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 panic attacks. She's like the, the Eddie of the friend group. This is it. What is what? Oh, did we find the, the mouth of the cave? You're having a laugh. I'm an English teacher, not fucking Tomb Raider. Oh my god. See you down there. Do you make sure your cows Oh, see? No, no. Do you hold on to this like that? Look, you know, I have done this before, you know. I'm only looking after you. And I appreciate it in small doses. <laughs> oh, ah, that looks awesome. So, we got six people, right? Are we gonna, like, kill people off one by one? There's no way all six people make it out. It's a horror movie. Like, that's not a... Not a possibility. It's beautiful! It is. Shit, move! Jesus. Holly, we do this safely, in order, following my lead, okay? Holly does not give a shit. Ooh. Don't, yeah, don't put your fingers in there. Is that human? Just some bloody fingerprints. Now you're gonna be soaking wet for the rest of the <laughs> Those bats look pretty bad. There's only one way out of this chamber, and that's down the pipe. How much do you know? I'm not sure if I trust you. I can't wait to see what we find down here. Because it's not gonna be pretty, whatever it is. Shit. Wait, is she going off by herself to look for the giggling child sound? Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Ah, okay. We're good. Everything's fine. No, see, this movie sucks. It's just a bunch of stupid-ass jump scares. All right, it's fine. Sarah? I haven't had a chance to say that I'm... I'm really sorry I didn't stay around longer after the accident. I found the next passage! I'm taking point, guys. Careful. Just find the way through. We'll wait here. Oh, absolutely not bad. The claustrophobia in me just spiked so hard. Water and rock this close? No. See, I like going into the caves from a touristy perspective, right? You open, you go in, it's a big open room, and you're just like, oh, look at the cave. This? Nobody should ever want to do that. I'm sorry. You're insane. Like, ah, uh, uh. Oh, I like the way they're doing the camera here, just kind of dragging it through in front of her. That's cool. Oh! No. Wait, did she go last? Oh, shit. That just sounded like somebody like, Yahoo hoo hoo -y, like Goofy. The claustrophobia is gonna be the worst part of this movie. Every time they sh can we, we don't, I don't need to see every single person come through there. All right, the tilty camera, the music, the claustrophobia, all combining to give me anxiety over a situation Sarah? I'm not even in. Yes. She's stuck, is she stuck? Is she... Oh my God. Shit. Guys, it's Sarah, I think she might be stuck. I am stuck. Okay, breathe, slowly. Oh, Just that looks terrible. Breathing. What the fuck am I? I can't. I'm dying, I can't. Oh, I can't, I really can't. Sarah, look at me. Okay, breathe. Breathe, oh, okay. where, where are your arms? Hey, listen to me. Because if my arms are ever pinned against my body, I will die. Listen, the worst thing that could have happened to you has already happened, okay? And you're still here. This is just a poxy cave, and there's nothing left to be afraid of, I promise, okay? Okay? Lies. Listen to me, you love this one. You love this one. How'd you give a lemon an orgasm? Come on, tell me what you say it. How'd you give a lemon an orgasm? I don't know. How do you? What did you do? You took his citrus. Okay, that's better. Come on. Okay, okay. All right, we're gonna move now. Take hold of my arm, all right? The rope bag. I forgot the rope bag. Okay. I don't give a fuck about the rope bag. Just keep going. 
Oh! Oh, oh. What in the Indiana fucking Jones just happened? Check the book! I didn't bring it. And this isn't Borum Caverns, is it, Juno? We're in the wrong fucking cave! Holly was right. Borum Caverns was a tourist trap. I Don't didn't... try and pin this fucking shit on me! This is not caving, this is an ego trip. Come Here on, Rebecca, go. I didn't know this was gonna happen. Where are we? It hasn't got a name. It's a new system. Oh, Jesus. I wanted us all to discover it. No one's ever been down here before. Fucking kidding. <laughs> You don't just take five people into a game no one's explored before and not tell them that. It's gonna be good for Sarah. Have you any idea who was that? No, what was that? Did you no. see that? You couldn't get away fast enough, you selfish cow! You know what was that? We all lost something in that crash. Did we? What did you lose? Just get us out of here. The man that you love that was already married? Because that's still what I think happened there. If we stay here, we'll die. Let's go. Okay. Oh, that's good. Wait, do you think someone's gonna fall to their death right here? I think so. Now would be a good time to start losing them. One of us has to get all the way across there so they can rig a line for you guys. Where's the other rope bag? Where is it? We lost it when the cave collapsed. Yeah, we did, didn't we? What? How the hell? Oh, does she have... Oh, I see it. Wait, maybe? Got it. I would not trust whatever the heck that is. It's probably a totally reliable tool. Not for me, it's not. Who's that? You okay? What's wrong? Is that a broken one? There's nothing. I'm all right. Okay. Wait, is that a broken one? Like someone else was here and tried to do what she's doing? Well done. How okay. did she do that? Turn on me the red rope. Oh God. I didn't get jump scared by the rope. I didn't. Was this about me or you? It's about us. Getting back to what we used to be. Oh. The one us to claim this place. Name it. I thought maybe your name. <laughs> or maybe yours. Boop. Uh, Juno! We'll need everything we got. Oh, she's doing it a risky way. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. <laughs> Oh shit! Nah, she's good. We good. We good. Let me pass. Rebecca, show me your hand. Ooh. Oh. Ow. Let's go. Let's go. What does it mean? It means we're not the first. This equipment's at least a hundred years old. No one oh, uses okay. stuff like this anymore. Besides, if anyone had been down here and made it out, they would have named it already. Hey, there's something down here. Is it a circus? Or an amusement park or something fun? Guys, it's amazing, but the batteries on our lights will run out, so I suggest we keep moving. Wait a minute, wait. Yeah, that's a good point. Why what are we using Beth? all of the lights Gina, at once? light up one of your flares. Beth, we don't have time for this. Just light a flare. Just light a flare? My god. What do you see? But the mountain, yeah, the cave, and there's two entrances. Is that what I'm looking at? I mean, I don't see how that really helps us, though. Like, we were looking for another ex- Daylight! I can see daylight! No. Holly! Can you really? Why? Where? How? Wait, is this when we lose somebody? Oh, shit. Sam! Get down here! Hi! Is she alive? 
It's not like she broke her neck. Hi! Answer me! Oh, she good? Okay! Dang, I hurt my leg! Uh, I didn't need... You know what? Put the bone back in the pants at the very least. Could you just shove your... Just, can you put that back in your ah, pants? No! <laughs> uh, the more real gore is, the worse it is for me. Like, the more realistic it is, and the more just, like, this could happen, the worse it is. So, a uh, broken bone poking through? I don't... I'm, mm -mm. No. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, that's fucking whoa. disgusting! Not here, not now! We need help! Everybody grab a corner! We need to move her out of the water! That magic goop from Harry Potter. Oh yeah, a giggling child again. What I was hoping for. I need to dress the wound and rig up a splint, but I can't do that while the bone is protruding. I need to push it back in. I don't. No, I don't want any audio with that. Wait. Okay. If I don't have to see it, that's fine. Is that a helmet? Yo. Oh. oh. I don't want. No! Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Oh, I can't. I can't. I don't do broken bones, bro. Oh. I don't. Oh, oh they got me this time. Okay, someone get me a medical kid. Okay, are we done? Are we done with the broken bone? Because I'm done with the broken bone, okay? Can we stay with you in the helmet and the creepy sound coming from over there? Who is it? Can you see it? Wait, what is it? Can you tell- what is it? What is it? Can you see it? Oh fuck. Oh. <gasps> Hi. Sarah thinks she saw someone back So what? I don't think I saw someone. I saw someone. No. She did. You heard something and you saw what you wanted to see. It's the dark. It plays Why would anybody want to see that? What exactly is the flame trick? Is right, it... Tana! Yeah, okay. So, like, if it flickers, this means, like, airflow. Are those bones? Are those... Bones? Those are... I'm not... Those are... I'm not insane, right? Those are all bones. What is this place? Bone city. Oh, 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 Dead ew. Hundreds of them. Oh, fuck it. Hello! Please. Is there Children. I got it. I figured it out. What's happening? Nah, oh, shit's shit. about to get so it's interesting. Oh, everybody. No, no, no. Play statue. Is That'll it? work. That'll work. Everybody That's play statue. Oh. You lost. The way in which they react to situations is very amusing to me. They're like, everybody stay perfectly still and quiet. And then scream and run in the direction that we want to go. What the hell is that? <laughs> oh, 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 Was that a broken dick? I can't tell who's winning. <clears throat> yeah, 
Yeah, got it. Oh. Ah! Oh. Oh my god, that's terrible. Why would you do that? Not you, like the movie. <laughs> This is so weird. Mommy. Mommy, are you ready? Ah! This literally is using jump scares in the same way that Insidious 3 did, and I don't appreciate it. Although, I love it, but I hate it. By the way, I can't wait to watch Insidious 5. I think I have to wait till like November though. Oh, ew. Oh, it's Panera, Panera Moral? Panera Moral activity. Yup. That's- Oh my god. Panera- Panera- Panera Moral <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know why that's what my brain said. <laughs> oh shit. Objectively disgusting. Are they blind? It seems like they might be blind based on like their eyes. Yeah, they cannot see. I don't. Ew. The worst part about it is they look like they are just humans in costumes, and that's. I just don't like it. There he goes! I just... Nah. I don't like the way they crawl. It looks like they had people crawl and then just put it in fast forward. <laughs> I swear to god, they just sped up these clips. <laughs> no, she's making she can bring every one of those things down on her head. As long as it's not on mine. I mean, fair. Yeah, you should stop screaming. Why are you screaming? Anywhere! Who is screaming? Shh. Alright, so they. I hate the way they move. They're so real, which is the weirdest part about this, because, like, I'm used to watching movies where they don't show you these things close up, because they know they look cheesy, right? Like, those look cheesy. They look kind of stupid, but, like, also just disgusting. It's weird that we're getting such a good look at them. Corners? Oop. Okay. Ooh. I don't like going back and forth. Go, just let it go. Oh, don't go. Don't go. <laughs> Woo! I knew it was coming. Hell yeah. Hey, hey badass Shuno's here. Good job. Dead. They took Holly. Beth's dead. Yeah, don't tell them what happened to Beth. I don't feel like anybody needs to know. Although that's gonna eat you alive. For the rest of your life. They're totally blind. And judging from what we've seen, I'd say they use sound to hunt with. They go to the surface to hunt. And they bring their food back down here to eat through an entrance. Ah. So I think I found the way out. The climbing gear we found. Whoever brought that down here marked their route. What are we waiting for? Sarah. I'm not leaving without Sarah. Yeah, where is Sarah? Oh. Found her. All right, we lost two of six. Are we gonna lose any more? Sarah! Oh, God. Oh, shit. Why is she not dead yet? That's miserable. Put her out of her misery, Jesus. I heard you not calling me. She did this to me. Not on purpose. She left me. 
I'm not leaving you, David. Okay. Oh, shh. Oh, God. Yeah, that's, uh... She's doing us. Yeah. She didn't do it on purpose. What? Oh, please. Oh, uh, yeah, she's gonna I ask her to. Yep. I can't do mm -mm. that. I can't do that. I mean, like, yeah, she isn't one of the toughest positions, literally, like, ever. Put her out of her misery or let her suffer. Oh, this is awful. I hate when horror movies do this shit. <laughs> That's horrible. That's like her best friend, right? Like from the beginning. That's who she drove here with and everything. Oh my god. Oh yeah. I was definitely done having a moment. Oh shit. Okay. Oh no. What is that? That looks... Like a, a fleshy, bloody pit of. Oh! Oh, no, thank you. <gasps> nope. What is that? She is badass as hell. Oh, that's probably bad. Why would you yell? Uh oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Ow. How are you gonna do this? Ow. Back up! You haven't got enough rope! Down! Turn around! Turn around! You can come back! Please, baby, listen to me. What's wrong with her? Please! <laughs> oh, God. Why are they everywhere? All the time! <laughs> Well, the dramatic fling backwards was really a, a, a touch that we added there. Yep, another one. Oh! So we are just gonna get down to the two main characters. All right. Hey, Bessie. What about Beth? <laughs> um, about that. Yes, I die. Kind of, sort of. What? <laughs> I just can't. <laughs> oh man, what a gooey, nasty mess. You know, yeah, just wipe it off on your pants or whatever. What? I mean, okay, this is Juno's fall, actually. But you're not gonna, like, kill Juno. Sarah, if you kill Juno... <laughs> what? 
Are you serious? <laughs> Did I miss something? Like, I know Juno killed Beth. But she thought it was a monster, that's why she did that. And then she left Beth because Beth was obviously dead. Wait, did she leave Juno to die? Seriously? Really? I'm just, I just, I don't know, man. I don't know about that. fall into the exit to the cave. Is that literally what just happened? Is that what just happened? <laughs> it's very evil bed. Oh my god, it's so convenient, right? Like, right by your car and everything. I can't believe she did that to Juno. I mean, Ju yeah, like, fuck Juno for, like, bringing them down there in the first place. Yeah, I know, I know. But still. Why are you pulling over? Why'd you pull over? Oh, okay. We just need a little... That's fair. No, no, no. It's fair. That's fair. <laughs> Why? Why? I feel like some shit's still gonna happen. Just... What? Wait, did she actually knock it out? What's with the birthday cake? Like, I get it, it's her daughter, but... But why do we keep showing it? Is she actually dead? Your, your dead daughter is gonna be scarred after looking at you like that. Why are you... Why are you looking at her like she's prey? And also there's... She's not there. That's just the torch. Is that actually- don't end the movie there. Are you serious? What? All right, so there we have it. That was The Descent. Um, interesting. Interesting movie. Very weird. I honestly do not understand, like, what happened at the end. To me, like, this movie is essentially about a bunch of women who have some interesting relationships being thrown into a cave together. They fight some things and then... They all die, and one of them seems to go crazy. Is she gonna, like, live in the cave now? Does Sarah live in the cave now? The whole thing with Juno, I don't know. It's hard for me to judge anybody in this scenario, but it feels like Juno just, like, accidentally killed her because she was under attack at the moment. She was in a life or death situation, and then what was she supposed to do with Beth? Beth was about to die, and, like, there were demon things around. Like, what was she supposed to do? I don't know. I th that whole thing was very weird. Sarah turned on Juno really real fast there. All right, let's talk about Juno for a second because um, I have now seen the movie technically a couple more times with editing. I just finished editing and I kind of get where Sarah's coming from now because I did realize eventually, yeah, it, I think Juno and Sarah's husband had an affair and Sarah maybe did or didn't know about it, but she was like very suspicious of it And I didn't catch on to the necklace thing Somebody on patreon just told me about that that the necklace was from the husband and like you should know that from the phrase at the beginning I kind of like missed that whole part So like there was that with Juno and then Juno of course took them into the cave when and, and didn't tell them what she was doing she's also in a way kind of not responsible for the accident but at the same time they were kind of it seemed like talking almost about the accident. I mean, the, the affair when the accident happened. So I feel like Sarah probably holds a ton of resentment toward Juno and that's why she does what she does. It still sucks. I love Juno. I mean, Juno, she's kind of an asshole, but I also loved her. Anybody else? I'll let you guys see the rest of the outro in a second here, but I think 
after watching it a couple more times, I can appreciate the movie more than I did the first time around. First time around, I just kind of, like, felt like it got very repetitive. I enjoyed the beginning. The ending was just, like, like, the second half was kind of boring. Once you got to see the creatures, I was like, okay, cool. And then it was just kind of dragged out for me. But I do have a greater appreciation for it, watching it a second and a third time um, as opposed to the first time around. So, yeah, I just wanted to give some updated thoughts on that. Anyway, yeah, here's the rest of the outro. Peace. I think the movie as a whole is fun. It starts off slow. I think there's a good chunk in the middle that's very fun. Then the end dragged out for me for a long time. I just feel like once you got to see the creatures, the, the constant combat with them got very repetitive and just not that interesting to me. But um, it was still it was still good. I don't think it's a bad movie. I just, it's not my favorite one I've ever watched. Also, I don't want to fault the movie too much on the visuals because it's 2005, but it is, it does look very cheesy. Like the effects were pretty bad and all of that, but like, that's fine. Like that's, I can, I can honestly appreciate that because the majority of the effects and everything were practical, which I prefer anyway. I think this was, this was fine. It was cute enough. I don't think horror movies want to be called cute, but that's what I'm going to call it. It was cute enough. It has some really good, strong moments, but I think as a whole, it drags out too much for me, like at the start and the finish. But otherwise, it's pretty fun. It's pretty okay. Honestly, it's fine. But anyways, thank you guys so much, as always, for being here, for hanging out, for watching the movie with me. I appreciate you so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.